Hey friends, it's Tommy with Thrifty Girl Treasures. And today I'm going to do my second get ready with me uh, while we just chit chat. Um, if you're new to my channel, thank you. Welcome back to my channel. If you're not, welcome to my channel. I am a part-time eBay and Poshmark reseller, and I also work full-time, and the eBay and Poshmark help to supplement my full-time income since I'm newly divorced. I'm also over 60, so I like to do get ready with me, um, come shop with me, uh, talk about skin care, talk about hair care, just you name it, anything and everything that uh, happens in our lives. So today I want to talk about uh, two things that I bought from QVC, which I am not sponsored, but I bought these products through QVC and it's just made my life a little bit more easier. And the first is from Peter Thomas Roth. <clears throat> And it's called InstaFirm No Filter Primer. And this helps to instantly tighten and uh, blur the uh, fine lines around your eyes and your, your you know, your chin area and um, uh, in any pores and imperfections. So you do have to shake it really well and I... Sorry, I didn't shake it before we came on the video, but anyway. So, I found that it doesn't take very much, um, and it is this color. Um, you don't, I don't think you get to pick a color, you just order it, but it does, it goes on pretty evenly. And I just apply it here. And I just kind of tap. Right in here. The, the right eye seems to have <laughs> more wrinkles than the left eye. Not sure why, <laughs> but it does. Then I just take a little bit more. And it's only about that much. It's, it doesn't take a whole lot. In here just put some here and then I put it down here in my chin area where I have more redness and then what's left I just kind of take it and do that yeah and so it tells you it takes about three to five minutes or seven minutes for it to dry. And you can feel it. You're supposed to stay completely motionless, but um, obviously I'm not because I'm talking. But um, anyway, I um, I got I got this product in last week from QVC. And I also got the uh, it's it's a um, I guess it was free because I didn't order it, but it's from Peter Thomas Roth, and it is um, Firm X Peeling Gel. Um, it's a gel exfoliant. Um, it visibly exfoliates by rolling and lifting and sweeping away, um, I guess, dead skin on your face. I haven't tried this yet. Honestly, I just keep forgetting to do that uh, on my nighttime skincare routine. Um, yeah, but I'm, I'm, I'm hopefully going to remember this to use it tonight. Anyway, so, um, one of the things that I also bought this weekend, this past weekend, kind of just to make my life a little bit more easier, <laughs> is this Lazy Susan from, uh, Target, not sponsored. Um, and it was, it's huge. It's really huge. Um, but I really like it because it keeps all of my... Um, you know, the stuff that I need to, to, uh, do my makeup with. So the next thing that I want to talk about real quickly is I've had, I've had this, this thing <laughs> for a long time and it has served its purpose. It still works. It still does a great job. Um, I thrifted it years ago and it's been with me for a long time. 
But, you know, I, I just find that as I'm getting older, I just need something more, more mirror, more <laughs> mirror space. And um, I just find that that's what I need. So I bought this from QVC. I'm not sponsored, but I love it. And I wrote a review on QVC telling them how much I loved it. And let me just show it to you really quickly. It's a monster, but let me just show it to you. Look at that. And then here's the back. And it the small mirror is the magnification mirror. It also has drawers. Each one of these pull out. And I, I can kind of do the top one. Yeah, I could. <laughs> it's heavy. It's really heavy. And then it turns on over here on this side. But I will provide you the item number in the description down below on this video. But anyway, I just wanted to pass that along because. This mirror has truly been a lifesaver for me, really, it has. Um, I kept it in a box for a week and I was like, okay, you gotta take it out because you know, I'm blind, I can't see. So anyway, I took it out and I have loved it ever, ever since. So, let's put on some makeup. I think this is dry, so let's put on some makeup. So as normal, I use IT Cosmetics. And um, this is about how much I use on my face. Sometimes I use a little bit more. And then I just dab it on. Gotta get the red and the nose. <laughs> and up here on my forehead. I don't put as much on my forehead um, as I do everywhere else. And I'm not sure why, but I don't. Um, this is uh, another brush from It Cosmetics. I've cleaned these, um, so yeah. So I just tap. I just tap, 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 and then I buff. And I try not to pull on my eye area too much. Um, but that's how I, I do it. I'm still nervous about doing these get ready with me. <laughs> um, I don't know why I'm nervous about putting on makeup in front of other people. It's just kind of, it's kind of weird to me, but um, I watch other people, obviously. Um, I don't know if you guys watch Rockstar Mom, but she puts on her makeup and I just love her. And um, I just ordered a, um, Contour, um, it's from Angie Hot and Flashy. It's, um, I think it's for concealer brush to, to apply concealer. Um, but I, I do have a brush for that and I like it pretty well. Um, so I may, I may use that brush for eyeshadow. Um, I gotta tell you, I, years and years ago, um, I got a pretty severe eye infection from, um, from using eyeshadow with glitter. <laughs> oh, I can tell you how old I am. Um, yeah, so I, uh, and this is just Maybelline. It's not by It Cosmetics. Um, I am going to order, order the one from It Cosmetics. Um, I think they're just out of my shade or really just really what I'm comfortable with with using and this is just a brush it's a little cheapy brush that um but I like it um for the concealer um but yeah so I ordered that brush from Angie Hot and Fleshy but oh getting back to the eyeshadow excuse me um, I did go out this weekend and it was on clearance. It's Jason Wu and I bought this palette from Jason Wu and um, it was on clearance at JCPenney, but it's okay. It's fine. I just kind of want to, you know, try to get back into the idea of wearing um, eyeshadow again. I think my glasses hide it. I, if I wore contacts um, a lot, I think... Um, or more, if I wore contacts more, rather, 
it probably would hide, um, you know, you could probably see the, the eyeshadow better. Um, I am going to get contacts. It'll probably be maybe the first of the year or at the end of the year, my eyes, um, the prescription changed again for my eyes, which kind of concerns me. I feel like going blind. Um, I have a small cataract. I think it's in the right eye. But anyway, um, I don't know, we'll see. Um, but I do, will have to get glasses and I do love to wear contact lenses. I just have to wear readers with them while I work and that's fine, that's perfectly fine. Just gonna switch the um, mirror over to here so that I can look at the, um, just so that I can get up close and put my eye makeup on. I just think it's a little bit easier if I can use the magnification mirror to put that on. Yeah, so years and years ago, I developed a pretty severe um, eyelid infection wearing um, eyeshadow. And whoops, I probably said this before, um, but I had to wear an antibacterial cream for about three months on my eyelids. So it kind of looked like I had Vaseline on my eyelids. Had to go to work that way. I could not wear mascara. Absolutely nothing um, on my eyelids. And I'm going to tell you, those my eyelids became pretty irritated and... Uh, so, yeah, I don't want to go through that again. But um, anyhow, hopefully um, I can start wearing eyeshadow again. I just haven't worn it in a very long time. And I just kind of let, let the natural shadow of my eyelids serve as, um, you know, as an eyeshadow would. Um, yeah, so, and then my, um, eyeliner is just, it's just like a Maybelline eyeliner. I think I got it at the dollar store, and I don't use very much of this. Um, because, again, you know, I kind of feel like, I'm going to flip this back over here on this side. I just kind of feel like my eyes, um are magnified so much, you know, by wearing my glasses. But, you know, when I do wear contacts, I do get compliments on my eyes. But um, for right now, we're just going to leave it at that, you know, just chalk it up to that. <laughs> uh, let's see. I always lose this thing. It, this is again from It Cosmetics. It's a brow pencil, brow. Um, and I just, um, my eyebrows are over plucked as usual um, because I have to pluck them almost every day uh, because they are, you know, over plucked. And then I try to do that. And I don't know if I look funny, but um, we're going to go with that today. Uh, just because I don't really, I mean, you know, when, when COVID hit and we all had to work from home at my previous job, um, I got really lazy and did not wear makeup. And, um, you know... I took great pride in the way that I looked when I went to work. I wore makeup every day. You know, my hair was, you know, I used to wash my hair every day. I don't anymore just because I have a love-hate relationship with this gray hair. I, ugh, I don't know. I hate it, to be honest with you. Some days, um, I absolutely hate this gray hair. Um, I haven't had it colored in about six months, five months, and it really needs to be colored. Um, and I like to do that for myself. Uh, I like to, you know, color 
get my hair colored and, um, you know, that's just a treat for me. That's really just, you know, a treat. And then obviously, um, the blush is It Cosmetics and the brush It Cosmetics. I love this brand. I absolutely adore this brand. I know that there's some people that, you know, they say they don't like it, but I happen to like it a lot. So I have a new Ipsy bag, November Ipsy bag. And out of that bag, there is a lip color that I'm going to try. It's this lip color. Let's see how it looks today. Oh. Oh, I like it. Do you like it? I like it. It's a little pink. <laughs> uh, it's a little pink, but I like it. Yeah. What do you think? I, I do. I like it. Um, yeah, so that is really simple. I really like minimal fuss on my makeup. I really like to get in, get out, get it done, and I really try to go as much as I can for the natural look. Anyway, friends, if you uh, like this video today, please, if you would, like and share my video. I would so appreciate it. I'm up to 20 subscribers. Um, I'm so excited. I know that's not a lot, but for me, <laughs> that's a lot. And I I am so excited about that. It's truly, I, I didn't think anybody would watch me, but um, I really appreciate that. So yeah, if you could, um, if you could like and make a comment and share or, you know, not share, but just like my video and be a subscriber, I would so appreciate it. And again, friends, uh, everything that I put on today, I will link it in the video da uh, down below in the comment section. And this mirror from QVC, I will link that too because I'm in love with this mirror. And I just think if you're over 60 gal and you got problems seeing, this mirror is going to be perfect for you. Or if you just like to put on makeup and you like to be, it's right, it's like right there, right in your face. Um, if you if you like that kind of mirror, this mirror this baby is for you. <laughs> anyway, friends, thank you so much for stopping by today. I look forward to seeing and talking to you in the next video. Bye.